there, you got to be led by your best players, and that certainly helps the Celtics get the championship. Because you got Jason Tatum, you got Jalen Brown, but only one of them could be Finals MVP, and it ended up being Jalen Brown. Got off to a great start in Game One. Score in the playoffs. What a season he's had. Brown goes inside. Oh, what a slam from Jalen Brown. Boston took game one, 107-89. Brown contributed 22 points, six boards, three steals, and three blocks. So now you go to game two, pretty much more of the same. He prides himself on being one of the best two-way players in the league. 21 points, seven assists, four rebounds, three steals, and this one spearheading that victory as the Celtics jumped out to a 2-0 series lead with a 105-98 win in Boston. Game three, of course, it went to Dallas, and that's where Jalen really went off. After scoring just six points in the first half, he exploded for 24 in the second half, including the dagger with the minute left to lead the Celtics to the win. Dallas Brown using the screen. Drives, pulls up, jump shot, punch it in. Jalen Brown now with 30 and the lead back up to four. How good has this guy been in the second half? Well, game four, of course, was a wash for Boston. So game five, you're back home. You're up 3-1. You got a chance to close it out. And what does Brown do? He goes for 21 points, eight rebounds, six assists, as well as two steals to help lead his team to the victory, earning finals MVP. He's the sixth different Celtic to win the award. And as Adam Silver said, Bill Russell smiling now that Jalen Brown has that trophy. What is holding 